power first. Power is right here at the top. It's labeled 16 volts AC. It is non-polarized, so you can put either positive or negative on either side. in there. The power is off on the unit. I'm going to go ahead and plug it in. Next thing is the strike. It has a normally closed on the uh, top side of it and has normally open on the bottom and has common in the center. For our strike we just have a regular normally open door strike. So we're going to go ahead and stick the common. And again, this is non-polarized, so you can stick it either way. And go ahead and stick the common in the center. And then normally open on the bottom half. Here. Next thing we got here is our telephone line, which is just your tip and ring. Comes up here on the top terminal, labeled telephone. And you want to use an analog telephone line with these if you want to be able to do remote programming off-site on your telephone. Use the digital line and the programming remotely won't work. Get the battery in here. Uh, this one is a battery we took out of the one we're replacing. So I'm going to go ahead and plug in the battery. And we've got the telephone line hooked up, the power hooked up, and the strike hooked up. And we bolted the unit on and we're ready to fire it up. First thing we're going to do is we're going to turn on the power. Go ahead and lock it up, secure it. 